what, uh, with, without a shadow of a doubt, uh, property taxes are so out of whack that you don't even need to own property in the state of Nebraska, and, and uh, we have to fix it. That's the most common sense approach to get it done, and uh, that uh, there's a, there's a lot of uh, possibilities with that. Obviously, um, caps another conversation because uh, you know spending. Uh, you know, I've asked this question a gazillion times across the state of Nebraska with groups. Is anybody in favor of inheritance tax? Unanimous. Nobody is, except, as I say, except for our friends and neighbors, we elect to run county government. They get in the, involved, and all of a sudden they, they got to live with that, quote, slush fund, uh, because that's what the inheritance tax is. It's not, it's, a extra, it's extra pillowcase money that we've got to start having enough discipline to be able to run our county government without it. And uh, so we have to become more fiscally responsible everywhere. Uh, we're working very hard to change that at the state and incredibly proud of the work that we're getting done and proof will be in the pudding there. But it's just really important that we have to become competitive. We can't say yes to everything. We have to understand who we are and spend money for the value that really matters. Uh, we can, we can, and we have to look at all the processes of what we do, whether it's in state government, county government, city government, and education. We can't keep doing things the same way, and that's why we have a committee of 12 superintendents working on Operation Clean the Closets Out. It's absurd that we're doing some things, and you know, start understanding what it costs to put an hour of training on so that somebody has an idea that would be wonderful. Well, it'd be really good to know what kind of return on investment that is. So we have a lot of work to do. Uh, we're not going to give up, and we're going to stay at it hard.